obviously the most in NBA history. Gets Golden State within two. There are not many people to score 10,000 points no. at all. He's done, He's got that on threes as Zubats gets the basket. And now we got a whistle and a technical foul is called here on Marcus Morris. Or is it on Golden State? Let's see. It's on Draymond Green. That's big. That's number 16, which means he's suspended for the next game. He is still barking at the official, Carl Lane. Now, unless that's rescinded by the league, he will not play in Atlanta Friday. And he's still going. Yeah, you can't throw the ball at people. Here's Curry, another one. Got another one. Back-to-back -back triples for Steph Curry. And now Draymond Green and Marcus Morris exchange words. DiVincenzo gets in the middle. Again, let's see. A lot of a lot of these tussles start, you know, a couple plays before. Yeah, that's a that's a foul on Morris. So it's the second foul on Marcus Morris. And they're going to see when it occurred in relation to the shot by Curry. I just want to make a point while they review this. The way the officials in general operate with Draymond as it relates to uh, high energy interactions. Yeah. He's he's allowed to get away with a little bit more and it you wa you watch the interaction he had with the official after his first technical a lot of guys would have been thrown out. And then here with Morris the contact above the neck above the shoulder Likely will be a flagrant one. And Draymond Green is still barking at Carl Lane. And in Marcus Morris, too. If there's an intent there, that's a, right? uh, if, if, look, Morris, everybody has roles for their team, whether it's Dylan Brooks, whether it's Morris here. There are certain guys that you expect them to get into the fray. The problem is with Draymond, he's so important to the success of their squad. Them missing a game, struggling on the road, you know, losing eight straight on the road. These are things that you've got to just be aware and try and be smart. We talked about it last game because we did the Warrior game. Yeah. He's got 15 with the amount of games left. What are the chances that he doesn't get suspend, suspended? It was zero. It was zero. It was, it was zero. But that's the intensity that he plays with. So, again, they're looking to see here whether this should be a flagrant foul. As of now, the three counts for Steph Curry, giving him 20 first-half points. So it's 59-57. Personal foul is the only thing that's been called right now, and that was on Marcus Morris. I want a little more time to look at this here. So you guys think this is a flagrant one? On Morris? Mr. Referee? Ah, uh, you know, I, I... I don't... I believe that this is a flagrant one. I, I, in my opinion... Nothing crazy. When you look at a tent, the way he threw his arms, the way he did that. Let's see. I'm always right. All right. Kevin Scott is going to tell us here what the ruling is. At least we believe he is. Having a conversation with the scorer's table because there's a lot going on here. After review, the ruling on the floor is a flagrant foul. Penalty two for unnecessary and excessive contact. All the components were met. to make one and Golden State will inbound at the free throw line extended with a shot clock to 24. So thank you very much, Kevin Scott. Excellent explanation. Are you surprised that it was a flagrant foul two, which is an automatic ejection? 
by his explanation, I guess not. Um, on first glance, second glance, it felt like a flagger one to Richard's point. But I understand. Look, anytime you are making contact on a non basketball play above the shoulders, you are opening up an opportunity for a flagrant two foul. Right, and with intent. We, we, we understand the intensity, how guys are going to box out, and there's going there's going to be some there's going to be some bodies moving down there. But the way he swung his arms, that that's again, you don't want to put yourself in a position where the referees get to decide certain things. And here, look, they had already been barking a little bit. Then here, like that motion right there. Yeah. Do you consider that windup? Because that was part of the description as to why they called it unnecessary and excessive physical contact. That three is off the mark.